Buongiorno conclusivo del diciassettesimo appuntamento con il Trasimeno Blues Festival e abbiamo il piacere di avere qui accanto a noi Mike Zito direttamente dalla band Royal Southern Brotherhood. Hi Mike, nice to meet you and it's a great pleasure to have you here. Thank you very much, nice to meet you, thank you. Zito is an Italian name. Your origin uh, are Italian? Uh, yeah, Sicilian, from Sicily, yeah. From, from Sicily. Uh, I know that uh, you start to play guitar, uh, loving uh, the music of Van Halen and uh, Led Zeppelin, is true? Absolutely, yeah, yeah. I was, grew up listening to rock and roll, and it led me into, into the blues. And when you change your style to a rock in to a blues, even if your style is a mix between yeah. them. But uh, it took time. I mean, I'm, I'm older now, 
So I started with rock, and I liked more the blues rock. And then uh, I started to listen to what they, Led Zeppelin and Rolling Stones listened to. Got into Muddy Waters and uh, Albert King and Freddie King and, and, you know, really enjoyed the blues. It took time. How it start uh, the uh, project of uh, Royal Briar, Royal Southern Briar? Yeah, uh, Cyril Neville, myself, and Devin Ullman got together last uh, year in New Orleans at Jazz Fest to write some songs and write some music, and uh, we, it went well. So then we, uh, we just we put a band together. We just took it, but it all started with um, I know Cyril and I know Devin, and I said, how come the Neville brothers and Almond brothers have never? We thought, well, maybe we should do it. You know? But why the blues have uh, more uh, uh, audience uh, in Europe than in America? I think, like everything else, the grass is always greener <laughs> somewhere else. Um, you don't know what you. That you don't always appreciate what's right in front of you. And uh, like the Rolling Stones came to America and made blues, made Muddy Waters famous in his own country by playing his music. It's just, uh, it's just the way it is, you know? Okay, what's the blues for Mike Zito? Just uh, something pure, raw, with emotion, the showing of your true feelings, whether it's a guitar playing or singing or the, the lyrics you know, from what's inside. Thanks, Mike. Thank you. Devin, so um, earlier we were talking about your tattoos and you told me it was a long story. Can you like break it down? Is it very personal if it's really personal? No, it is, but I, I kind of got them uh, on tour in different cities. This is uh, Sanskrit. It goes all the way across. It says, blessed, transforming student of the universe and music. That's really beautiful. <laughs> Tell me how you guys got together. Well, uh, Cyril Neville and Mike Zito and myself, uh, we all have the same manager down in New Orleans. And uh, they were sitting around one day and they were saying, you know, I wonder why the Allman Brothers and Neville Brothers never like, jammed together or toured together. And he said, well, I have Allman and a Neville and, and Mike Zito, this great blues player. Let's, uh, let's put them together and just see what happens. And, you know, anything can, uh, can look good on paper. It uh -huh. looks, looks strong, but... Uh, you know, we've, we've all had our own careers for years, so we wanted to see first if, you know, if it would gel, if we could write. And it's like a year and a few months later and we're in Italy, so life is good. Life is good. How long has this group been together? Well, a year and a half now. Mm -hmm. And probably, um, well, is it a year and a half? Yeah, it's about, about a year and a half now, you know. And like he said, I mean, you know, we, we recorded the record in December. The record came out um, May the 8th. And here we are in Italy right <laughs> after that. So, you know, everything's good, you know. All right. Uh, what cities have you hit here in Europe? Oh, so many. It's like I don't, and I couldn't pronounce the names of them anyway. <laughs> but, you know, it's a lot of many. And we went uh, one uh, date in uh, Spain uh -huh. and uh, one in Austria. Okay. So you know we this was a pretty, pretty good trip that we did, and we're coming back to Europe in October, from October the 14th until November the 12th. Well, we really enjoyed the concert tonight. We thank you very much for staying here and doing the interview, and uh, we'll see you well, next year, hopefully. Like we want to be. Everybody in Europe's favorite new band. 
I think you are already. <laughs> Good night from Chazimano Blues. <laughs>